hi glow babes welcome back to my channel if you're new please don't forget to hit the subscribe button i hope you guys enjoy this one because <laughs> this one is on fire like look at that like that the hair is giving me life okay guys as you can tell so if you're interested please keep on watching Okay, so I'll be using my old con rose from my previous look. I did have in um, sewing weave and a closure for Christmas, so that's the same braid, okay? Work with what you have. It's not looking that bad. The edges are all jacked up, but it's okay. It will work. There is always edge control. <laughs> so, guys, I'm just showing you guys. I'm using the thread and needle to um, sew up that the ends so it's you know all flat and even I just wanted to mention that this is my hundredth YouTube video I cannot even believe it but I'm excited and this month will be a year of me posting my very first YouTube video which will be February the 25th I am so excited so guys it's like I just made a hundred YouTube video and then my one year anniversary is coming up being on YouTube from my first video uploading my first video so guys I'm I just want to thank you guys for um, being with me especially for those who have been with me from the beginning of this guys thank you thank you thank you I just can't believe it oh my gosh guys I'm excited okay but thank you The hair I will be using is Features Braid Junior and the curl pattern is Boho Kinky Junior. Tell me why I bought 5 packs. Guys, you only need about 3 packs that should be good enough. And yes, the color I will be using is the T530. You will need your latch hook because this is a crochet installation. I will be using my wild growth hair oil to oil my scalp before install installing the hair. And it begins so guys I know you can't see that good from here so trust me I will speed it up until you are able to see it properly and I will do a slow-mo of how I install and how many knots I, I um, tie okay so be patient it's coming it's coming so I switched the latch hook because the purple one have a bigger hole and then the pink one is a smaller hole if you can tell because the camera is not focusing right there you can see <laughs> so guys I switched it because the hair is not like when you it's very skinny so the small hook will work so that's the color difference and I'll be using the pink one so right here it's one pack that's how much one pack did basically half of my head so I'm telling you do not buy too much because yeah like I have two extra packs just sitting I think I'm gonna exchange it and get a different color and reinstall because I love this hair so that's how it's looking before cutting it and the hair I just love it okay like ooh, life <laughs> If you are interested in my room decor, I do have a video up on my channel showing you guys how I clean and decorated it for Christmas. So I'll go ahead and link that the video in the description box down below. I'll also link my bathroom decor as well because it is matching my bedroom. So go and check it out and let me know what you think because <laughs> uh, my room is looking amazing, okay?
so the hair was getting in my way so I just put it away so I can clearly see what I'm doing and all of that like I don't want to knot um, one hair with something else that's already knotted so I'm about to show you guys a slow-mo so you guys can see how it's really done guys it's so easy so you put it in the latch hook you close the hook you pull it through and then you will do well I did two knots so then I will open up that little thing right there <laughs> guys don't laugh okay and then I'll do two knots okay so that's how it is I'm gonna show you guys one more time I think it's best you watch than me explain because the struggle is real so once you do that those two knots make sure you tight it so it's you know it's tight not slack so you can get loosened so one more time I will show you guys the process So right here I'm filling in the part area so you see more part and less braid so I'll be filling it in until you know I'm, I see you know not that big of a space so guys that's very important make sure you try and fill in those areas that that is noticeable because you don't want to see the braid so put in as much crochet as you can just so you know the parts look the part look more you know natural and less braid That's how the part is looking and I'm about to show you guys my edges. There is no braid that is showing. I fill it in. Avoid the edges. <laughs> and guys, I'm about to use the mousse to, you know, contain the wildness. I love that mousse. It smells amazing, okay? The mousse will also define the curls, okay? And it's good for detangling. Well, of course, you'll need some scissors when it comes to that part, okay? But, yes. <laughs> That's how it's looking without cutting anything guys. I'm loving this hairstyle. I will also leave pictures at the end of the video because I ended up cutting it like a couple days later into a bob so stay tuned for that. And that's how much hair I, I have leave back. So I might end up exchanging those two packs for not a different color because they do have multiple colors because I do love the hair. So that's how it's looking. <laughs> 
without being cut and yes i was looking out cute and now that's how it's looking now that's the the, the length i have it right now so guys if you enjoyed this video please go ahead and share to your friends and family please give me a thumbs up please subscribe and hit the notification bell so you can be notified on every time i upload a new video i love you guys for watching i love you even more for saying until the end Mwah. bye